Welcome back to the BT Young Scientists and Technology Exhibition here at the RDS. Incredible excitement on this, the 50th anniversary of the event. Over 500 projects here. There's been some incredible work done by the students. I'm looking forward to taking a look at it. Why don't you join me? to see and do here. Everyone is so excited and having an incredibly good time. But the big question is... Who is this year's winner? Or winners. Mm -hmm. And Karina. <laughs> Expect to head inside to find out. Check this out. <laughs> Are you ready? Let's do this. Good luck to all of you. The BT. Clark, congratulations. You are the BT Young Scientist for 2014. How does it feel? Uh, amazing. Uh, unexpected, <laughs> what I'm going to say. <laughs> well, I'm sure you put an awful lot of work in. The title of your project is Contributions to Cyclic Graph Theory. Yeah. What does that mean? Oh, I, I suppose I, I put a canopy over uh, a bunch of problems that I've been working on over the past six or seven months. So uh, in the subject of graph theory, which is a branch of mathematics. So, uh, yeah, so I'm working on these unsolved problems over the last six or seven months, and I've basically been coalescing together in this, uh, this project for the Young Scientists this year. So. And you came up with a project that really impressed the judges. Congratulations, you have an amazing year ahead of you. Enjoy every minute of it. Amazing energy in the hall. Congratulations to all concerned. But we've come away from the chaos now to a little bit of calm. I'm speaking to Nicole Palmer from Kildare. Now her project was all about plants and water acidification. But Nicole, have you enjoyed yourself? Yeah, I did. I met a lot of friends here as well. And what was the best part? Just getting through to the BT Young Scientist is the best part. Well, it really was a huge achievement to get here this year because there really was a lot of competition to make it this far. There have been some amazing highlights here over the last few days. Take a look at some of them. some fantastic moments from this year's BT Young Scientist and Technology Exhibition and we're looking forward to doing it all again next year.